For years, I was committed to an up-tempo melody and a chirpy two-step. But now I've been inspired by a new commitment. A commitment that has brought me to what they call the Great Rotunda. It's funny. That's what I used to call the late, great Toby Fields. <laughs> and it's because of that commitment that I've chosen to toss my hat into the political arena, as it were, and announce my candidacy for the presidency of these dual United States, including Puerto Rico, which works out perfectly because my lady happens to have a home there. <laughs> the preceding was paid for by the committee to elect Jackie Rogers, Jr. Jackie Rogers, Jr. on the issues. Our relations with Eastern Bloc nations, as it were, are like a very bad roadshow production of the Helen Keller story. Zero communication, man. Funny story. Not three weeks ago, I was skinny dipping with a lady friend of mine when suddenly something brushed against my thigh. And for a fleeting moment, I thought, Eureka, Jackie's in luck. But it was not to be. For it turned out to be a dead mackerel man. I don't know. It gets you thinking. I'm not 110% sure of my facts on this one, but if it's just a matter of a couple of grand, good Lord, I've got that on me. I don't think anyone, not even in the deep south, man, can argue with the fact that this has been Michael Jackson's year. Although, as a performer, my heart goes out to a certain Mr. Lionel Richie. The preceding was paid for by the committee to elect Jackie Rogers, Jr. Jackie Rogers, Jr. cares about working America. Hi, how are you doing? Please remember me at election time. I'm interested in ruling your land. Fact of work can be a bummer, huh? <laughs> Long day, I suppose. The fact of the matter is that foreign countries are dumping steel in the market and completely undercutting American industry. Good Lord, man. And this is... You heard this? I'm floored. Is anybody getting this down? You know, I once worked in a factory for a summer as a teenager, and the thing that I could never get over, man, was the damn noise. Good Lord, the machinery. Bang, 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 bang. And the company don't even have a hot lunch program, they don't. So that if you don't eat enough in the morning, you're hungry again by noontime, you are. With this information in my head that you have given me, sir, I'm angered. You have got to be identifying with the recent smash film starring the wondrous Miss Jennifer Beals. Is Jackie right? Let me guess. You're off to a club to dance the wee hours of the night away, followed by a brisk on-stage shower. I'm going to vote for Jackie Rogers Jr., I am. You should vote for him, too, you should. The preceding was paid for by the committee to elect Jackie Rogers Jr. This is an SCTV News Update with Earl Cannonbear. In a shocking and unexpected move, Jackie Rogers Jr. has withdrawn from the presidential race. This has been a controversial and hectic campaign since it began five days ago at the Las Vegas caucus, where his longtime friend Rose Marie placed his name in nomination. Jackie's campaign has been plagued from day one, when he was unable to complete his own celebrity 50-yard dash to raise funds for his candidacy. But it was his loss of the women's vote due to his public brawling with his common-law wife, Angelique, that sealed his fate. At one point at a luncheon for the Daughters of the American Revolution, Rogers screamed at his wife, and I quote, Look, my whore lady, all you or any woman wants is a charge card. Regular servicing on your demand, and... And... It goes on here. <laughs> 